Good morning, everyone. Uh, sorry about all these lighting issues. I'm doing all this from my phone today, and uh, it just doesn't focus. It's weird. It's weird. Either way, I'm going to go out and do some geocaching today. Uh, more of that social distancing. All right, so we'll see you at the first cache. Have fun. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights I did take a picture of a church, a historic church that was near this first cache that I found and I will put that right here. And now we're off to the next cache. Alright, found this one. I'm going to try to put it back into the building here. Uh, but it's definitely not on the starboard side. And we'll see at the next cache. Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground Keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down one of three ways, uh, geocaching at them, GC at them, or GCA, depending on how big or small the log is. Do you have a way to shorten your name too? If you do, why don't you write in the comments down below uh, how you uh, log your caches when you find them, depending on how big the paper is or the log is. Um, and do you, mark, do you mark in your log how you signed it so they can come back and verify it? Um, let me know. All right, I'm going to put this back and... Uh, We'll see you at the next one. The thing I like about geocaching in the spring is sometimes the late falls and you can see everything. The thing I don't like about geocaching in the spring or the late fall is that everything can see me too. Won't stop for traffic lights. Alrighty, I'm gonna take about a half mile walk, four tenths of a mile, whatever, uh, down the trail here. A lot of people. Um, there's a golden ammo can down there. If you're not sure what a golden ammo can is, I'll let you know. Uh, another question for you: Have you ever found in a golden ammo can? Uh, and uh, do you have one dedicated to you? Uh, I have one. Uh, post in the comments below whether or not you have one dedicated to you and whether or not you found one before. And uh, we will see you when I get to this one. Jumping from cliffs so high 
trust in our wings to fly. Sometimes we're crashing down, but we get up and start from the ground. And I, I really wanna know really Every single one of those says this is not the log except for one, and I found it. The log is signed. So I'm running all over the place looking for this cache. It says it's magnetic. Magnetic. I've looked all up and down this thing. It brings me right to this point here. But I went all the way down there. I've looked. I've looked. I've gone around. I've looked everywhere. I've looked down there. There's nothing magnetic there. I even looked over there just in case. And um, yeah, I'm about to quit. However, there was one thing that caught my eye just as I was heading back to the Geomobile. Uh, and I'm just going to check it here. Are you kidding me? Really? Are you kidding me? And guess what? It's really magnetic. Anyways, I'm at the Battle Island State Park. Uh, it's a golf course slash state park. There's two geocaches here. I'm going to try to grab them uh, right now. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Will ever figure out where the road goes I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground and I, I know that the sun is getting low uh, Just about 10 miles up the road There's a trail I guess that has five caches on it Five, I know you can see over this humongously large steering wheel um, there's five geocaches there, and uh, I'm going to try to get over there before it gets too dark uh, and see if I can get those five caches out of the way. Um, I think that would be a good streak for today, uh, for me anyways, the DNF king. <laughs> Alright, so we'll see you at the next cache. Hi, even if the sky is falling down. of five uh, the sun is still there um, I think the last two caches one like I said is at the beginning and one is, I'm assuming it's got to be back towards the car so I'm gonna hit those and hopefully we get them before the sun goes all the way down only got about what um, that much so about that much before it goes down yeah, we'll be good. See you in the next cache. Let me figure out where the road goes. Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. You can say a lot.
All right, that's four of the five I need to find. Um, this one is signed. I'm going to put it back. Uh, and the only other one that I'm missing uh, was the one back where I parked the car. Uh, so I'm going to hustle myself back to the car uh, before it gets way too dark. We're still, I think we're still good, but you know how it is in the woods. It gets darker quicker than it does out there. So uh, we're only about a half mile from the shores of Lake Ontario, but there's a lot of private property over there. So, um, all right, so I'll see you at the, the next one. Hopefully I'll find it. Uh, like I said, it's a little tough. Boom. All right, back at the car. Uh, I am back up at the front, and I cannot find that. Um, I've searched everywhere where I think it would be, where I think it could be, uh, and I'm just going to mark this one as a DNF. I think it's a perfect way to end my day, uh, considering I call myself the DNF king. And, um, yeah, so that's going to be it for now. Uh, remember, get out and geocache, wash your hands, click like, click subscribe, and I will see you out on the trail. Peace.